Hey everyone, welcome to a new episode of Get Good at Opera Roller Coaster Tycoon 2. Now, when you uh, build a park in a scenario, usually you'll have these uh, park fences around your park, and it may not always be uh, what you want. I What I like to do is to put my own fences around the park, and yeah, that will generally just look nicer. So, for example, we could uh, place uh, some fences here. Um, yeah, let's just uh, stack a few types of uh, fences. And I'm not gonna do the entire park, just this little section here. But of course, um, yeah, there's still this uh, this park fence around the park. But um, in Open Rollercoaster Coaster Tycoon 2, there are actually ways to get rid of this fence around your park. And when you have to, when you have to do a contest inside a scenario, it is it will usually look much nicer if you get rid of these fences. So um, one way to do this is uh, in the tile inspector. You can access the the tile inspector through this uh, shuffle icon. You may need to enable uh, cheats in the options, but then uh, you will see the icon and then you can uh, use it. So um, to do that, you simply select the tile outside the park, which the fence is on. As you can see surface here, and you click remove park fences, and then the fence uh, just disappears. To get the fence back, you select the tile again, and you select Restore Park Fences. So yeah, when you uh, remove the fences, it may be difficult to uh, to find them back again. Uh, so I recommend only doing this after you've uh, yeah, filled your, your park with, uh, with fences on the side. Something else you could do is uh, to simply uh, change the color of the of the floor in your park. Oops, I need to uh, only to do the land painting. For example, I've now just changed the floor texture in all of my park. So now if we uh, remove the fences, it's easy to find back uh, which styles they used to be on. And this is also useful when, we, when you've removed uh, all fences. Just so you know where your park boundaries are. So, um, well, you can imagine with the tile inspector method, you can only do it tile by tile, but there's also a faster way to uh, remove all the park fences in your park. So for that, first you need to uh, enable debugging tools if you don't already have it enabled. So under options, you can find it under the wrench icon, um, enable debugging tools. And then when you press the key above the tab key, uh, which is usually a tilde or a squiggly, something like that. Or here you can uh, select this and then you will open the in-game console. So to remove all the park fences, we simply type remove underscore park underscore fences. And all your park fences will be invisible. And because we just painted uh, our, the ground in our park, we still know where the park fences used to be. So now, for example, uh, you could also uh, just make the fences again without worrying that you built outside the original park boundaries. There we go. That will usually look much nicer than the uh, original fences. Alright, I hope this tutorial was useful for you. If you have any more questions, feel free to ask them in the comments or uh, ask them on my Discord server. The link is in the video description. Alright, hope the tutorial was useful for you and I'll see you again in the next episode. See you later!